In a narration found in Sahih Muslim, number 6586, the Holy Prophet Muhammad, peace and blessings be upon him, declared that the Muslim nation is like one body. If any part of the body suffers pain, the rest of the body shares in its pain. This narration, like many others, indicates the importance of not becoming so self-absorbed into one's own life, thereby behaving as if the universe revolves around them and their problems. The devil inspires a Muslim to focus so much on their own life and their problems, that they lose focus on the bigger picture, which leads to impatience and causes them to become heedless of others, and as a result they fail their duty in supporting others according to their means. A Muslim should always bear this in mind and strive to aid others as much as they can. This extends beyond financial help and includes all verbal and physical help, such as good and sincere advice. Muslims should regularly observe the news and those who are in difficult situations all over the world. This will inspire them to avoid becoming self-centered and self-absorbed and instead aid others. In reality, the one who only cares about themselves is lower in rank than an animal as even they care about their offspring. In fact, a Muslim should be better than animals by practically caring for others beyond their own family. This narration also indicates the importance of unity and equality in Islam, as one must aid other Muslims according to their means, irrespective of their gender, ethnicity or anything else. The same way a person desires to remove their own distress, they must strive to behave in this manner for others, as the main narration clearly indicates that for a Muslim, there is no difference between them facing a distress or another Muslim facing a distress. It is one in the same. Finally, even though a Muslim cannot remove all the problems of the world, but they can play their part and help others according to their means, as this is what Allah, the Exalted, commands and expects. Over 400 free ebooks, audiobooks, infographics, podcasts, and blogs available on our website www.shakepod.com